certain, this should be a ripper of a day. This is a damp pitch, almost too damp. You sense that the ball will hold up a bit off it. I don't expect much pace, and it might be quite difficult to play strokes. Having said that, it's a beautiful day for batting, so on the toss, bat first. He's chosen to bowl because the pitch is so wet. It'll almost stop on the batsman, and that'll make it very hard to judge your stroke play. It might be one that necessarily moves around sideways. Welcome back to the second session of what has been a most interesting contest so far. The players are out in the middle, and in the commentary box is Richie Bell. Marvellous stuff, beautifully played. You couldn't imagine anything better. Don't even bother chasing that, that's the way to the bleachers. Great strike. Great strike, six from the moment he hit it. Watch out. Excellent bowling. It's straight and it's full, and in the end, you miss, buddy, and I'll hit. Miles, he's hit it, miles. Facing is Hamish Marshall. The batsman will have to reassess the field now that those fielding restrictions have been lifted. Remember, five for him. Well, a player of this class came completely down the wrong line. It's made a terrible mess of the stumps, too. Huge! That is huge! Still going up as it cleared the rope. Oh, it's a monster. Fulton facing. Fulton waiting at the striker's end. That over eased the pressure on the batting team. Boye is switching to round the wicket. Field his appeal, but uh, he was quite comfortably home. Fight, fight, fight. Or all the way. Show them the maker's name. That is a perfect example of the straight drive. So beautiful to watch, too.